now in this video we will create another function for our load model but first we will go right at the desktop and here as you guys can see that assets zip file we will extract that here and I will provide this right in the resource you guys can easily download it from there okay now as you guys can see that asset folder in here we will simply drag and drop this right in the fruit get x okay refactor there we go as you guys can see the asset folder in here there are two images and there is a labels.txt file and there is our model okay now this model has been trained for these fruit names okay as you guys can see in here total 10 okay close this from here close it now we will simply create a model function right in here okay so load model and this will be a sync take this down from here so in here first write await there we go and there will be a tf light dot load model okay now in here there will be this model first let's import the library for the tf light in here there one tf light dot dot now in here there will be that model okay and in here there will be that label all good semicolon in here now write in this model we will simply write in the name of our model as you guys can see right in the asset folder that one in here we will write it okay so and make sure the name must be same okay so write it flight all good right after this in here right in the label write this labels fruits.txt in here okay so assets slash the name label with the s fruit with the s dot txt okay so this all for the load model function now in here we will simply override the inner state there we go and right in here there will be this model name copy it paste it in here okay all upon that now right after this we will override this post okay there we go now right after this in here first write avid and basically this will be async so in here write async there we go okay and then tf light dot we will go with the clause there on sign right after this camera controller there we go dot dispose all good now and that's all for this video right in the next video we will work further